All right, again, a blessing, a privilege, um, and a pleasure to have the king in the building. So we'll get it rolling. The king is there, of course. It's Fever TV, Canada's first black-owned uh, television network. Big thing going on on this side. So, um, yeah. Our first interview with Beanie, so this one is, is very special to me. Um, so that being said, um, literally relevant for five decades in the business, 187 number one, of course, Jamaica Hit Parade songs, a Grammy Award winning top billboard selling artist, um, 21 albums deep, not including the, uh, the compilations, the undisputed king of the dance hall. We welcome Beanie Man to Fever TV. Beanie, good afternoon. How you doing? Blessings, man. How are you doing? Listen, everything is good. And, um, you know, you'd think that with a resume as long as that, Grammy Award um, wins, you know what I mean? 21 yeah. albums, not including the compilations deep. You would think that you'd be slowing down, but it seems like 2020 is just a start. Yeah, man, it's, there's no slowing down a, a man that's going to do what he's doing. So right. No, it's, it's, it's like you're going to take away a man's feet and tell him to stop walking. Right. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> so it's crazy. It's more music. So the yeah. first time I heard of of Beanie Man, of course, the ten year old DJ, the invincible Beanie Man, the ten year old DJ, and mm-hmm. and so here's my first question: um, the album came out when you were ten years old, which yeah. means which means how young were you when you started? That's kind of crazy to me. Ah, okay. I, I started music professionally at age five, really. Believe at me, age five? Me. Yeah, because music actually gave me advice because I was born a stammer kid. So, I couldn't farm no sentence plus a word. Right. So, I get to realize that when we do sing, the word flow better. There's a, a little discomfort right now that um, a lot of reggae artists and reggae fans are dealing with because it would seem that as much success as Versus had with the dance hall edition of it, that they're not really paying it its due. And specifically, um, of course, we know that uh, Swiss Beats had to alter a photograph because originally Billboard left out um, Beanie and Bounty out of the equation. Yeah. The story they did on, on Versus, the phenomenon. So, can you, can you... Uh, I have nothing to say about I'm on Magazine. Is is their magazine? Is it? Um, yeah. Yeah, the thing I can say about your cover is your cover. You understand? Right. I, I, I just, I know fight people for their opinion. It's your opinion. You say this is what it done for our culture. It bring up about the old time R and B artists where we, them them them, them now a long time like Jill Scott and give yeah. thanks to versus so they could have see back DMX and them thing. I understand where they're coming from because they matter about their culture. Right. And what music do for them? Remember, Billboard is an American magazine. Right. See it? But if you mention Versus, you gotta have to mention us, Absolutely. because he is the one that bring the vibe to Versus. And right. then after every Versus, everybody start get together in the same room, because right. we is the one that start that. So people find that disrespectful in people's yeah. mind. But I cannot tell a man what to do. So I have to, to, to support the fans in any way them feel about that. If the fans feel disrespected. I have to support them because we cannot tell them, say, wait, wait, do that, do that, do But me, right. as an artist, we cannot tell a man to do what he want to do in a magazine. Right. So if he want to draw it to feel himself, that is said. See, I respect Swiss beat them for come out and show them, say, this is where you go wrong. You shouldn't right. have been timbal on you, so you should have been the man and bunty killer. Yes. So the life of a king is a being the man concert. It's mm-hmm. going to be there on Friday, this Friday. This Friday, all right. Friday, this Friday, people. This Friday, it's not next week Friday. This Friday, the 14th of August, <laughs> this Friday. And look out for the 22nd of August is my birthday. I'm going to be live online playing my album. So people, just stay tuned and, you know, yes. enjoy. The undisputed king of the dance hall, Moses Davis, a.k.a. Mr. Vineman. Thank you yes. so much for your time, family. Blessings. Zaga, zaga, zana, amna. Fever TV. Nah. Watch me. Catch the fever. Hmm. In other E time, yeah, you better have some fever. Zaga, zaga, zana, amna.